everyone, how are you? In this tutorial, I will show you how to use Wirebox Studio. This is an interactive web page that allows you to create interactive videos by simply adding tags. First of all, you have to enter Google and then you have to search for the web page wirewatchstudio.com. So you write this here, wirewatch.com, and you press enter. This is the main page, then you have to sign up. You can sign up for free, of course. So you have to go here, you have to click on sign up. Then you have different options. The first one is to sign up with Google, then to sign up with Facebook, or the last one is to create a new account. So, for the creation of a new account, you will need an email address and a password. As I've already created my account, I will click on here, and my email will automatically appear, and my password also. So, I click on here where it says sign in, and I will enter. This reminds you that you have only 14 days to try this web page, but don't worry about it. You have to click on continue. And here you can see the different videos with which I was working. So, I told you before, here I have all my videos. Here I have the number, full five, four files. And here you have different options which help you to organize the different files. You can organize them depending on the day, depending on the file type, different options. So, you can create a folder in which you can organize your different files or you can upload a new file. So, we click on here and you have different options. You can use a file from your computer, so you click here, you choose a file, or you can paste a um, direction. So, if you go here, you go to Google, you copy the link of a video, and then you paste the link here, you add it, and the file will appear here. Then remember that you have to upload the video. Okay, this part takes a few minutes, so I don't want you to spend so much time uh, watching this video. And I uploaded a video before, but I will show you this option. You can move it, you can preview it, you can del delete it, or you can select different options. As I told you before, I will use the video I uploaded. Here it is. So you can edit it by clicking on here. Once you are here, you can preview your video to check if it, it is correct. Then you have to look for the text that have been detected. So, look, you have different suggested devices or you have different suggested objects. Yes, look. It detected bicycle, bus, car, chair, or the different faces. You go to one face, you add a tag, okay? You name the tag, okay? You gave this tag a name. For example, Rita, which is the singer's name, and you add it. Then you select an icon style, for example, bounding box, circle, countdown, hot spot. You have a lot of options, and this will be the way in which the tag will be shown to the people who see the video. For example, we will choose this one, which is called bounding, bounding box. You will apply it, so you click on here. This asks you if you are sure about this tag, you click here where it says OK. You select the position, it can be here, here, whatever you want. OK, we will place it here. So, then you have to select the interaction of this tag. So, we will play here, where it says Edit Overlay. And you have different templates, OK? You can select one which is 
pre-design or you can design your own template. We will choose this one. You select the image and you go here where it says select images. You click on here. You use images from your computer. Yes, you have to. You need previous files. So you go here. You choose one of these. I have the same here. You have to delete this one and to choose one. Okay. We will choose this one and we will save the image. So the image will appear here. And then we will change everything here. Okay. We can add the name of the artist, Rita Ora. We can add something about her, for example. She is a singer. And you can use this as a bottom. Okay. Click here, for example. It's time to change the size of the letter, for example. Look here to change the size, for example, you add another number, a bigger one, for example, 30. You change the type, for example, this one, and you change everything from the text, okay? Here, for example, you can change also the colors, yes? This one, you can choose everything. And once you are, okay, right, once you want this to be saved, you have to click on here. So you save this part. Now remember that you have different options, like add text, add image, add bottom, add video, add map, or add a frame, okay? So now we will, for example, here we will add this, okay? We will add a link. For example, we will add this video. So we copy the link as we did, we did it before and we will copy this here, okay? And we will save it again. So now when we press the button, the video will appear here, okay? This will show you the video that I uploaded there. Okay, now that you are happy with your work, you go back. So we save it before, so we go back and we go back again. So was to go to the main page. Here it is the possibility to share it. Of course, if you can, if you have luck to share it, you go here and you share the link or you can upload this to your Facebook account. Just to finish this interactive video, I will show you a video that I made before with different tags. So I ask you to have an idea of how it functions and how it works. So I go here, which is my video, and I will show you. You have to click on here to see the video, and here it is. Look here, look the different tags. Press here. And look this, here is my template, and here where it says Rita's biography, which is the bottom, you press here, and this page will open. Then you close it, and you continue, listen to the video. You can go to the next tag. Here it is. You press here and you can see the text where it says New York, Upper Manhattan. It is best known as the Big Apple. And you can see the place where it was filmed, the video, the singer's video. So you see it. Okay, now you close it again and the video continues. You can go to the last tab. Here it is, you press it and you will see this image, you will read this, listen to another song, you click here and 
you will be able to listen to another Rita's song, okay? So this is all. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And well, that's all.